Flying 200 can feel like an incredibly complicated thing, but this video is going to look at the basics, the things that you should always do if you're the fastest person in the world or if it's your very first time on track. The first lap is all about getting to the top of the track as efficiently as you can, avoiding any spikes in power and trying to save energy that you'll need later on in the effort. What this means is rolling up to the fence in the straights and dropping down slightly in each bend as you climb to make the upward hill as smooth and consistent as you can. Once we're at the top of the track, we're going to start building. You should never slow down in a flying 200. If you do, that shows that you worked too hard earlier on in the effort. We also want to make that power curve as smooth as possible, which in reality means accelerating downhill and holding speed uphill. That focus will really help you flatten out your power. In the last lap of build, this is really personal preference. How fast you should go is best found out through trial and error. And now we come to the all important line. You want to make the downhill as long and consistent as possible, avoiding any uphills whilst aiming for the apex of the bend to really help you nail that black line. Then just ride fast. <laughs> 